today. Most of the biggest corporate welfare recipients are actually at the Beverly uh, Country Club in the Chamber of Commerce golf outing. So today we are hosting the People's Putt-Putt to sort of draw a contrast between, to try to change this false debate that there's a debt crisis when really there's a jobs crisis. The, the course today highlights how difficult it is for working Chicagoans, but how easy it is for uh, corporations and the rich to continue to, you know, steal the profits of the country. Well, we have one hole, actually the first hole, which shows how easy it is for corporations to, uh, it's, a, it's an automatic hole in one for them. Um, they're receiving billions and billions of dollars in taxpayer money and, and uh, huge tax subsidies and corporate welfare and uh, hoarding it, not creating jobs. And then the second hole is actually the people's hole, and it shows the difficulty that working Chicagoans have in trying to make a living and get ahead. Uh, their efforts are blocked by things like high unemployment, the stuff that's really holding working Chicagoans back from getting ahead. I think this is just a way to kind of engage people in a different way. People can kind of do something and learn and not have to maybe be at a protest where lots of people might not feel comfortable in that environment. Um, this is sort of a pop-ed way to reach more people who might not know about these um, topics. So.
Stand Up Chicago is um, a campaign that's affiliated with 20 different organizations throughout the city of Chicago and working to end corporate welfare and also work for job creation.